Welcome back to the 805 Barbecue Junkie. So for today's episode, or today's cook, I got ranchera right here. <clears throat> this is beef flat Angus beef. I'm going to leave this fat. I'm not even going to clean it up. Just the way it is. So it's pretty simple. Get the orange. I got a uh, navel. Very in California. Just squeeze a little bit. You know what? I shouldn't have flipped. Get some lime. Doesn't matter what orange you use. Just whatever orange. Juice orange. You have on hand. Man, it's already smelling good. I haven't even done nothing to it. So we do that, okay? Here's the star of the show. Can we get it? Can the camera pick it up? Don Sazon. Sazon. I was a taquero. And this is my go-to seasoning for my asada. This is bomb fire so just season try not to see it season too heavy do both sides just like so okay I missed a spot You guys got to try this. It will knock your socks right off. So at this point, I just add a cebolla. You can add anything you want. You can use brown, white. It doesn't really matter. And uh, some cilantro. That's it. That's all we do. So I'll get another piece and I'll demonstrate one once again. So get the orange juice, right? Or the, the juice of an orange. So I'm going to wrap this up with foil. Let it chill in the refrigerator. Minimum four hours. I'm going to try to go four hours because it's kind of late today, but minimum four hours. We'll come back and I'll show you how to cook this. So check it out. So it looks like. I got all those juices already accumulating there. I just started a fire we're gonna use oak red oak today guys you guys are gonna enjoy this video that's for sure so the fire has been on maybe an hour so what you want is the coals just these coals that's it a bed of coals that's what we're cooking on today a bed of coals we're not using no grill no nada this is going to be our salsa. Just go ahead and slap the jalapenos on there. You got to keep your eye on, on this stuff. Because they'll go very quick. So basically, lo vamos a tostar. So he'll be here, I don't know. It just depends how hot the fire is. Just stay on it. I know what you're thinking. Oh, what about that ashes? All those ashes. Am I going to get sick? Nah, man. Nobody's going to get sick. This is how they used to do it in the olden days. In the caveman days. Matter of fact, this is caveman style. You know, watch out, Lajo. All you want to do is just toast everything, man. You can be anywhere cooking like this. You don't need a grill. You can just use straight coals. 
and we're putting the meat on there too. But we're gonna do the salsa first because the meat's gonna take a couple minutes max to cook. You know, a little ha a little ash didn't hurt anybody, but you get what I mean, right? Clean clean all this up later. You know, bien tostadito. See, and then we just peel it off, man. Look at this, it's beautiful. Oh man, it smells good too. This is how you know when it's ready. When you when you squeeze the garlic and it's soft, when it's really really soft inside, that's when you know it's done. Here's a jalapeno. I'm not gonna do nothing. Just just accept. Just cut off right here. If you see any ashes, well here's a jalapeno. If you wanted to peel it, you can peel it off. Doesn't matter to me. Throw it in. Semillas and all. You don't want it too that spicy. Take the seeds out. The tomatillos. Just toss them in there. My tomatoes. Beautiful, beautiful tomatoes. A little bit of ash, right? Just clean off. Do your best, or you don't have to clean it off. But in this sake, we're gonna try to clean them off the best we can. Voila. Ahora sigue el otro. You guys can't see from the camera, but. That's it, just try to Clean it off. Let's see what else I have in here. This one you can peel it off. You don't have to, but we'll peel it off. Hey, I'll leave everything in there. Got one more jalapeno up in here. Que pique, que pique la salsa. Squeeze it all out. No, it ain't gonna, it ain't gonna fly. Check out this onion. <laughs> Looks all crazy burnt. Just peel it. Peel all that. Char off. Mind you, it's hot, real hot. Bomb. Perfect. It's good. Watch la salsa. It's gonna go good with these tacos. Got the carne right here. Ooh, looks bomb. Here we go. First piece. And de depending on the thickness of your carne, the depending how long it'll take to cook. I only have enough room 
to set one piece of meat. So we just let her go. Looks good. Fire is not that hot like I want it to be. But it'll work. <laughs> My wife says no, she ain't eating this. It smells good. It smells real good. So it's right here. I mean, it was on the coals maybe three minutes. All right, guys, time to check the carne out. It's been resting five minutes, not too long. Here it is, man. It smells good. Let's cut up into it. Always cut against the grain. For this meat right here, the flat meat, grain goes this way. So I'll cut against it. Squeeze a little lemon. <clears throat> Going for the bite. Mmm. Damn. The ranchera, full of flavor. I taste the onion, cilantro, the orange juice, the lime. You guys gotta try this on the real. It is really, really good, man. The salsa is even better. But. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video. Gracias. See whatever comes to mind, what I make next. Well, thank you guys. I'll see you guys next time.